Alright everyone, looks like we reached the end of the game. There's no heading back now, even if we wanted to. So, let's go see what's gonna happen in Asgore's room. Oh wait, this is different. Isn't it? Oh no, it's still the same. I forgot. We had this one room in between. You know what, actually while I'm here, maybe I'll check real quick and just take a look at uh, the coffin again. Just out of curiosity. Hmm. Right down these stairs. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Try. It's empty. Hmm. Still not sure what to think about that, but... It's the end of the game, so I guess I'll figure it out soon enough what that all means. Some very interesting things to think about. Um, and I think some things have been purposely misleading. Let's see, is Asgore still here? No, he's still in the other room, I guess. Let's catch up to him. Yeah, no save points at all. So I hope we do this right, otherwise we'll have to play that all over. Oh, we do get a save point. There we go. Now everything's good. Hello everyone, and we're back again with Undertale. You might notice I took a short break in between episodes, or maybe not quite as short, as you can probably tell. So yeah, I didn't know that it was going to end there. We're at the bar again. This looks like it's going pretty much the same as uh, the original playthrough, like the other scene we were just at. But yeah. I was gonna, like, leave off, but I didn't know there would be a save point, so since there actually was one, I decided to stop the session there. And of course we're gonna continue. We can't even go back at this point anyway, I don't think. This is it. Yes, Asgore. This is the end, my friend. The end of our journey, or voyage, through the underground. Ah. Got the hearts available again. Only ours is missing. A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. Yeah, it's just horrible if you look at how sad Asgore looks in the scene. You're filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. So we- oh! No wait, this is new! Alright, so we don't do the fight over again. Who is that exactly that- Toriel! Aww. I had a feeling when I saw the fireball coming at her. Or had Asgore, rather. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel. Your friend and guardian. Yeah, it's funny how she says basically the same thing she does at the beginning of the game. But I cannot stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous. That it was. Much treachery along the way. And ultimately it would have burned you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You'd have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone live here, leave here even. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. I guess he does. I would give him mercy, but you know how it went. Tori, you came back. Did not Tori me, dreamer? You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free your kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul. Really, he could have. Taken six souls from the humans, then come back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair. Because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Yeah, he never really wanted a war. Tori, you're right. I am a miserable creature. But, do you think we can at least be friends again? <laughs> No, Asgore. Aw, poor Asgore is crying. Look at that. Yeah, Asgore, human. How did you get here? Nobody fight each other. Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I'm Toriel. Are you the human's friend? Yeah, that's our friend Undyne. It's nice to meet you. Uh, yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> hey, Asgore. Is that your ex? <laughs> Jeez, that's rough, buddy. H hey! Oh, now you're coming here too. Nobody hurt each other. Yeah, we've already been through this. You're a little late. I'm Toriel, hello. Hey, yeah, everyone's getting introduced to each other. Uh, uh, hi. There's two of them? Oh, now look. Hey, nobody fight anyone. If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. Oh, Papyrus. Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst. Hey, human. Did Asgore shave? No, that's... 
That's not us, Gore Papyrus. Hey guys, what's up? That voice. Oh! Yeah, they finally get to meet each other. Oh, I think we may know each other. Know each other? Yeah. You guys know each other. Don't you recognize each other's voices? I thought you just said you did. Oh, hey, I recognize your voice too. I'm Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans. And, uh, same. Oh, wait then. Then this must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It's so nice to finally meet you. <laughs> your brother told me so much about you. Wowie. I can't believe Asgore's clone is who I am. Oh, Papyrus. This is the best day of my life. Hey, Papyrus. Where is the skeleton tiles roof with? Hmm. Snowproof roof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles is roof with shingles. I changed my mind. This is the worst day of my life. <laughs> now he has two of them to deal with. Come on, Asgore, it's gonna be okay. Oh, he's still traumatized. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Y yeah, Asgore. I that's just an expression, though. I hope you don't mean that literally. Undyne's totally right. Sometimes you just gotta uh, stop going after furry boss monsters and uh, just get to know a really cute fish. I don't think that's exactly what she meant. It's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh, and Metaton shows up. Oh my god. Will you two just smooch already? The audience is dying for some romantic action. Hey, shut up. Man, the nerve of that guy. Right, Alphys? Uh, Alphys? <laughs> no. He's right. Let's do it. Oh, look at everyone. They're looking all wide eyed. Well, uh, I guess if you want to, then don't hold anything back. Whoa. Got some serious lip action going on. Whoa! Interrupted. Not in front of the human. Uh, right. S sorry. I got a little carried away there. <laughs> oh, now they're all together again. Aw, all our friends that we made. It's kind of cute how they're all together this one last scene. My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you've made, I think... I think you'll be happy here. Yeah, you know what? It's actually not that bad after all. We've made quite a few friends along the journey. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know how to call everybody? Well, let's just say, a tiny flower helped me. Papyrus, that's not a good thing. A tiny flower? Oh, no! Oh, he's back. You idiots. Oh, Flowey, I can't believe you're still here and doing this kind of stuff. Well, you guys are having a little powwow. I took the human souls. And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friend's souls are going to be mine too. Hehehehe. <laughs> and you know what the best part is? It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you. All the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and the human souls together, I will achieve my true form. Hehehe. <laughs> okay, DBZ Flowey. Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. And if you win, you won't get to play anymore. And what would I do then? This game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you, just within your reach. And then tear it away, just before you grasp it. Over. And over, and over again. Hee hee hee. Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring back your friends. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that won't happen. You. I'll keep you here no matter what. Oh no. I don't think we have much maneuvering room around here. <laughs> Even if it means killing you a million times. Well, this isn't quite fair, Flowey. It's even worse than last time. Uh-oh. Someone help. Please. <gasps> Was that Toriel? What? Do not be afraid, my child. It's just like in the beginning of the game. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. Oh, and it restores my health, too. Oh, and Papyrus and Undyne. That's right, human. You can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you. <laughs> hey, human. If you got past me, you can do anything. 
So don't worry, we're with you all the way. Huh? You still haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on you. Oh wow. Technically, it's impossible for you to, to defeat him. But, but somehow, I know you can do it. Human, for the future of humans and monsters. You have to stay determined. Oh, and all the other monsters are here too. The kid, the volcano, Shiren, Froggit. Oh, and the Spider Queen. Erg, no. Unbelievable. This can't be. Oh, even the dogs at the bottom of the screen. You. You. I can't believe you're all so stupid. All of your souls are mine. Oh no. I guess that wasn't the best idea after all. But I guess it was the thought that counts, everyone. So what the heck's gonna happen? Is that the end of the game? Oh. Oh. I think I know who this is, guys. And you guys probably know by now, too. Yeah, that's his true form, all right, I guess. Makes sense now. Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. Yeah, that's... the resemblance is uncanny. It's their kid. Howdy, Try. Are you there? It's me, your best friend. Whoa, okay. So he has an even finaler form, Asriel Dreamer. Yeah, that's them, alright. Their kid, anyway. It's the end. Let's check him out. Legendary being made of every soul in the underground, infinite attack and defense, whoa! Alright, so this is... Just like the attack that- oh, we got hit at the end, come on. Just like the attack that Toriel had. You held onto your hopes. And, As and Asgore as well, for that matter. Alright, so our damage is reduced. The true final battle is finally beginning. Okay. Think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory getting smaller and smaller. Alright, I'm not sure what that does exactly. The space in your inventory gets smaller. This is absolutely insane. This Maybe not as crazy as the uh, last battle of the other route, but still pretty crazy. Shocker breaker. Hope. You keep holding on to hope. Damage reduced. I think that might be more effective though. If it reduces the damage we take. I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Huh. Okay. Whoa. Well, they give you some warning, but it's still pretty tough. Kia Saber. Hmm. Keep holding on to hope. Even restores a little bit of our health. That's good. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. So what's... Oh, he's got two swords. Are we safe here? Whoa. Alright, so he switches sides. That's good to keep in mind. Azrael charges Shocker Breaker. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna take a chance here. Let's see. I guess use the CT. That increases our speed, so that might help out with making things easier, too. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. It's funny, he acts like he, uh... Knows it's all just a game which he can erase. It's kind of funny. As you already star blazing. Was that the one at the beginning? It might have been. The shooting stars. Then we'll do everything all over. Whoa. Okay. This last part's pretty crazy. Oh, we got hit at the end again. It's the worst feeling. Chaos Buster? Which one was that? I don't even remember. Let's try to keep these attacks in mind so I know what to do. You know what the best part is? You'll do it. Whoa, this is new. Oh. Ugh. Alright, so some of those you dodge, and then some of them they'll go around you so you don't need to dodge. Chaos Saber. Well, that was a tricky one. Uh. You know, I'm gonna do hope for now. We're still above half health, so. I'll keep going. Then you'll lose to me again. Oh. So we kind of want to be under him. That's essentially the trick to it. The side that he's on is where you're safe. Ready is the Chaos Buster. I guess what we can keep on doing is hoping, since that restores our health slowly anyway. 
and again. Ooh, I hate this one. Stay still, dodge. Stay still. Oh, almost forgot. Oh. Just got hit towards the end, but we almost had that perfect. Shocker Breaker 2. Alright, well that's a new attack. What do we do for this one? Yeah, I'm gonna heal because I don't want to take a chance with the new attack. I mean, it sounds like the same as the other attack, but it might be slightly different. Whoa, okay. I think it's even faster than the original one. Oh. It's hard to dodge it at the end there. Galacta Blazing? What is that? Well, we'll reduce our damage. Unless you have attack from DBZ, like Vegeta's Gallic Gun or whatever. Because you want your happy ending, yeah. Of course we'll keep trying, we're not gonna give up so easily. You should know that. You have to stay determined. Just like Asgore taught us. Ashwood Cools on Chaos Slicer? Jeez, so many attacks. We kept holding on, damage reduced. Because you love your friends. Yeah, that's true. Oh, it's just like the other one. Is it the same one? Maybe I just forgot the name. Whoa. Alright. Still fell for it a little bit. Chaos Blaster. Uh, yeah, we'll heal. Uh. No. We'll hold on to hope. Because you never give up. Ugh. Maybe I should have healed. This is what I get for doubting myself. Now we're probably gonna die. Oh, crap. There we go. Oh no! Oh my god. That was so close. I wasn't expecting that bit at the end there and we almost died. Isn't that delicious? Yeah, that hot dog was delicious actually. <laughs> your determination, the power that you get this far, it's gonna be your downfall. Okay. Well, we're in good shape now anyway. I probably shouldn't have let things get so close during that last attack though. That one was kind of dangerous. Hyper Goner? Jeez, what an attack. What a name, even. We kept holding on. Damage reduced. Now, enough messing around. It's time to purge this timeline once and for all. What the hell? Alright, this is pretty crazy now. Oh. Wow. The sound of this attack reminds me of, uh... Like, the spell Ultima from Final Fantasy VI or whatever. It makes, like, the sound seems... Whoa. We only have one health left? You after that attack, you're still staying in my way? Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky, kid. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Just like a typical DBZ villain. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Okay, perfect cell. Let's see what you have. So, what is it? Whoa. Azrael blocks the way. Well, he definitely looks a little different this time. Got some more intimidating music in our, uh, soundtrack. So what can we... We can't actually move, it seems. Can't move your body. But hold my true power. It actually won't let me pick anything else. I was actually trying... Shit. That wasn't quite fair. I think we automatically got taken down to one health, too. But it refused. Okay, so we can't die here. That's good. Azrael blocks away, but we still can't do anything. So we can't move our body for any of this, so I guess we just have to wait. Every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life here will end in a world where no one remembers you. Okay. Well, I can dodge it most of the time, but chances are we're gonna get hit at least once. Still can't move our body. Still you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. Okay. This is gonna be a major pain. Is there anything we're supposed to do? Just struggle, I guess. Can't move your body. Rahaha. <laughs> Still? Come on. Show me what good your determination is now. Mm. I guess it isn't much good in this fight. Oh, wow. The whole world is ending. Can't move your body. Nothing happened. It just fades to black. You struggle, but nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file. Nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file. Nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. Why would I want to save here anyway? It's a terrible place to save. But maybe, with what little power you have, 
you can save something else? Oh, like what? What can we- Oh, all our friends! Alright, let's try it. We'll save Undyne. We should have the Azrael Solon called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? I guess so. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. Yeah, they're all in there with him. The lost soul appeared. Let's see, what can we do? Hmm. Fake hit, I guess? Like old time's sake? Let's have the lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight is familiar to her. All humans will die. Oh, it's just like the old fights, too. Okay, whoa. This might be a pain depending on how tough it gets. Lost soul stands there. Let's learn a recipe from her. How do we cook? Come on, Don, you must teach us. She doesn't know why, but she kind of wants to teach you how. She remembers. You're a real enemy. That's not true at all. Okay. Whoa, shit. Too slow there. Lost soul stands there. Lost soul. Smile. A big smile, like you remember she likes to do. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back to her. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. Well, I'm glad that we account as one of them. You feel something faintly resonating within Azrael. Ooh, is it working? We actually can fight now, but I don't think that's the right thing to do at all. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. Let's see. The lost soul appeared. Alright, let's do it. Oh, it looks like we have the green heart now, so I wonder if it's going to be like the shooter game. You tell the lost soul that you'll continue to support her. Something about the way you said that is familiar to her. You hate me, don't you? Well, that's not true. Alright, let's kill as many of these things as we can. Oh, now we just have to dodge them. Out of the way. Okay, well done. Lost soul stands there. Um, I guess we can nerd out together. Yes, the lost soul, what her favorite cartoon is. She can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. Yep, she gets excited about that. I've gotta keep lying. That's not true. Oh, the bombs. I hate these. Okay. The lost soul stands there. Come on. Help me with the quiz question. Okay, we asked for help on a quiz question. Does it work? Suddenly, memories are flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you too. Aw, that's awesome. You feel something resonating within Azrael. Okay. Papyrus, you're next. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. It's actually kind of easy, but it's really fun having- Oh, there's two of them. Both Papyrus and Sans. Okay. But I think it's cool how you go back to like the old battles and you do the same uh, puzzles. Like now we're blue, so we're probably going to do the jumping. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Of course he wants to help us. I must capture a human. Just give up. I did. Woo. Jump again. Stay still. Uh-oh. They always try to trick you- Okay. I thought that was gonna be the last one, but it wasn't. Kept on going. The lost soul stands there. Let's see. Hmm. Sands would like a joke. Told him a bad pun about skeletons. He seems to love it. But the other lost soul seems to hate it. <laughs> then everyone will. Why even try? Come on, Sans. Don't be that way. It's funny. I'm not used to Sans being so depressed. He's just such a cheery guy. The lost soul stands there. Back to Papyrus. Let's see if he can teach us a recipe. Yes, the lost soul to cook something for you. Make us spaghetti. He's trying to hide his joy. You'll never see them again. Wow. Whoa. Uh. Just a little tricky. The lost soul stands there. Alright, Sans. Let's finish it. Maybe with a, a judgment. Break from fighting you. Not to Ted solemnly. I guess I picked the wrong one. No, wait. You're my best friend. I'm rooting for you, kid. I could never capture you. <laughs> oh, I wanted to see what he said if I picked Judgment, but I think I slept on it. Toriel. We'll be Toriel and Escort at the same time. The last one was. The Lost Souls appeared. Okay. You refuse to fight the Lost Soul. Maybe she'll remember this. Something about this is so familiar to her. This is for your own good. Forgive me for this. Aww. I know you guys don't mean it. Come on. Oop. Aww. I didn't make a sharp turn at the end, but I didn't have time. The Lost Souls stand there. Alright, let's do Asgore. Hmm. We'll talk to him. He seems to like talking. We're gonna- we're gonna save everyone. Yeah, we are. Something stirs deep within him. 
No one will leave again. This is my duty. No, we can take care of this. This will be our duty to save the underground. There we go. They stand there. Back to Toriel. Oh, we can give her a hug. Our preference. Yeah, the, the cinnamon. That's awesome. Somehow she faintly recalls hearing this before. <laughs> I kind of expect her to say something more, but oh well. Maybe once we save her, she will. I guess we'll finish up with Asgore, though. We'll give him a hug. He needs one. He's had a rough life. Suddenly, his memories are flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. So, I think that's it, right? You feel your friend's soul resting within Azrael. Someone else? Strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began resonating within the soul. Stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? I think we know who it is. Suddenly you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? What are you doing? Hmm. Oh, we're going back to the beginning. But this, this is the very beginning. This is when uh, they first met. Back before this all happened. Because she originally fell down there a long time ago. I guess. Yeah, and they became good friends. They were raised together as siblings. You feel your friend's souls resonating within Azrael. Hmm. What? What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No. No, I don't need anyone. That's not true. You once did. And you still do. Jeez. That's a little harsh, man, don't you think? Well, I'm gonna save because I don't want to die now at this emotional moment. Come on. Stop it. Get away from me. Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart. Oh. Oh, his attacks has already gotten much weaker. Look at that. So much easier to dodge, too. We can save you. You just have to let us. Try. Do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? Well, why? Tell us. Oh, look! He's doing the same attack that Toriel did when she refuses to hit you. So he's not gonna fight us anymore. Come on, Nazriel. I'm doing this because you're special, Try. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. Come on. We don't need to fight anymore, man. It's over, Azrael. No. That's not just it. I... I... I'm doing this because I care about you, Try. I care about you more than anyone else. Aww. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. Well, this is pretty heartbreaking. So, please, stop doing this and just let me win. Oh, he's attacking us. Point 0.9, point 0.5, point 0.1, stop it. Stop it now. Wow. Look how low it's going, but we won't die. It refuses to die. Ezreal. Try. Yeah, we can do nothing but save him now. I'm so alone, Try. I'm so afraid, Try. Try. I. I. Is that it? Oh, he's back to being a little kid again. I'm so sorry. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Try? I know. 
You're not actually Try, are you? We're not? Try's been gone for a long time. Um... What... What is your name? Frisk? That's... A nice name. Frisk... I haven't felt like this for a long time. Yeah, you're slick as a flower. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monsters as well. Hmm. They all care about each other so much. And they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you now how everyone feels about you. Papyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are weird. <laughs> Even though they barely know you. It feels like they all really love you. Aww. <laughs> Frisk, I... I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. Aw, we can't hate you after that. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. How could we not forgive him after this? That'd be horrible. To not forgive him. But what? Frisk? Come on. You're... You're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is to return them. But first, there's something I have to do. What is it? Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire. To get out of here. With everyone's power, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. <laughs> oh wow. So he's gonna use the last of his power to free everyone. And does that mean he's gonna sacrifice himself again? Barrier was destroyed. Asriel. Frisk. I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. Aww. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. That's horrible. Is there really no other way? So frisk. It's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people who love you. How could you not comfort him at the end after all that? After everything you've been through in this game? <laughs> I don't want to let go. <laughs> it's cute to have that little animation for the hug even at the end. Frisk. You're... You're gonna do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Hmm. Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. Take care, Azrael. 
By the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? That's horrible. Like, they'll never even know what their kid did for them. Or will they? I mean, they were kind of, like, merged inside them for a while, so maybe they will now. Frisk. This is all just a bad dream. Please, wake up. Uh-oh. Aww. We're surrounded by everyone. All their friends. Oh, you're awake. Thank goodness. <laughs> we, we were so worried. It felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have to freak out. <laughs> Tell us the next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Wow, they all just thought we were taking a nap? Yeah, you make Papyrus cry like a little baby. What? I didn't cry. I don't cry. Oh, Papyrus. I just... I just caught something in my eye. <laughs> yes, that's what it was. What'd you catch? Tears! <laughs> oh, Papyrus. Never change. Now, now. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Oh, they all know our name now. Here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? Something is so odd that we're actually a character called Frisk after all that. It'll make you feel better. Er, how about we give them some space first? They must be very exhausted. Though, from what? I'm not certain. Frisk. We do not remember exactly what happened, so they don't know. There was a flower, and then everything went white. But now the barrier's gone. When you're ready, we will all return to the surface. It seems the door to the east will lead us there now. But before then, perhaps you might want to take a walk. You can say goodbye to all of your wonderful friends. Aw. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Ah, we can talk to everyone. Howdy, Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. Yeah, <laughs> small stuff, water under the bridge. I feel very bad about it. I hope we can still be pals. Ah, we can manage. Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Ah, that is true. Well, actually, Sans didn't. Sans is the exception. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. Wait, you should be sorry, it just... Asgore, that's not what I meant. <laughs> Psst. F frisk Um, you've got to tell me. Do, do you think that Asgore and Toriel are... Uh, ever going to get back together? Hmm. I mean, they may at some point. You can never tell. Y yeah. Yeah, that's what I hope too. Just think about it. How cute they must be together. It's quickly becoming my number one ship of all time. Tori and Gori. My... my old boss and his ex-wife. Uh... That sounds a lot less cool of a sudden. Yeah, it kind of does. <laughs> so, Althus. What do you want to do now that we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. Let me guess, they're gonna go to Japan. What? Well, well, of course, I'm gonna go out and... Um... No, I should be honest. I'm gonna stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. That's the spirit. Everyone, a celebration of being losers. Oh, Papyrus. Heh. <laughs> Papyrus has the right idea. Losing the Frisk is the best thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> it's funny how it's kind of true, actually. So I'm glad we are. Huh? What is it, Asgore? Um, what's an... An anime? Oh, Asgore, don't get them started. Oh my god. Frisk, please. H help me explain what anime is to Asgore. Y you see, it's like a cartoon, but... But with swords or with guns? It kind of be either one, but with swords, I guess. So it's like a cartoon, but with swords. Hmm. Golly. That sure sounds neato. <laughs> Asgore, that's old-fashioned. Where is this? Where can I see the anime? Uh, hold on. I think I have some on my phone. Oh no. Here, look at this. Uh, oh, uh... Um, that's the, uh, that's the wrong... Uh, never mind. What did you show him? Golly, were those two robots... 
kissing? Oh my, what do you watch, Alphys? Boy, technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> I just love how old-fashioned he sounds. <laughs> it sure is. So, Asgore, how about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal Guard anymore. Aw, oh, poor Papyrus. What? The, then what was the point of the human's quest? Uh, I think there was something other than that. They journeyed all that way, and I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard? <laughs> Truly, this is the worst possible ending. <laughs> I'm not sure, Papyrus. I think there are worse endings if, uh, whatever it is to be believed. Oh, hey. What's up, Frisk? We were just talking about you. Were you now? Apparently you asked to call Tori mom right after meeting her. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that is kind of true. You actually remember that, huh? Well, it's not right after. It took a couple of minutes first. Frisk, I gotta tell you. That's, uh, not the best way to get to know someone. It's not? <laughs> Papyrus, we've been over this. Whatever, mom. <laughs> Don't talk back to me like that. Go to your room, Papyrus. Oh, poor Papyrus. Uh, okay, Undyne. Wait, don't actually go to your room. I'm getting mixed messages here. Papyrus can't handle being confused like that. It's not fair to him. Hello, Frisk. Alpha's upgraded my phone. Oh, did she? I'm having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Oh, no. Don't get started. Sand, check out this one. Oh, man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the queen has returned. And also that she's a huge dork. You two are two feet away from each other. Why are you texting? Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a very good reason. And why is that? Well, it's because we're two huge dorks. <laughs> oh, Sans. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of a bonehead. <laughs> wow. Those puns are even less funny coming from her. <laughs> and why are you smiling? It's a pity smile. Oh, wow. I wonder if we can call our friends here. If they respond in any way. Well, I guess not. Oh, well. well maybe, uh, Toriel, now that she can text. You notice that you received a text from Toriel. Ah. Do your frisk. Sans and Alphys are teaching me how to text. I'm learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? I think I have an idea. Please look at this. Yeah, I notice. Now turn your head to the left. It's a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? LOL. That stands for lots of laughter. Well, does it now? Well, I guess it can. Sincerely, Toriel. That's all for now. Maybe in the next room, you'll receive another. Ah. I guess I'll have to keep up to date on my text messages now. Now we finally get to use Toriel's phone after all, after the whole game. Dear Frisk, how are you? You've been wandering around for quite some time now. I hope you're not getting into trouble. No. Only kidding, lol. Sincerely, Toriel. P.S. Do not get into trouble. <laughs> well, I think we'll manage. Alright, let's save our game here. So it sounds like we'd actually go back through the entire game and kind of retrace our steps. So you know what? I think that's something we'll do. In the next part, we're going to go through the entire game and see if we can talk to everyone yet again. We'll have a lot to talk about too, I'm sure, about this ending and the game overall. So until then guys, take care and stay determined.